You held off Sarah Kate there in the 100 and, uh, and held her off again and uh, she came in third in the 200. Must be happy. Yeah, I'm delighted with that, yeah. It's my first ever time meddling in schools at all, so having two goals in one day couldn't ask for more. Is that right? <laughs> yeah, first time. <laughs> so, looking, looking ahead then, this must give you huge confidence for your future career. Yeah, hopefully, especially for the rest of the season. Hoping a few more PBs will be on the cards, you never know. <laughs> looking outside and looking uh, at club level as well as school level, what are you going to look at doing in the future then? Um, definitely just continue with the ones and twos, see where it takes me, that's about it. You've no aspirations to try and move up a distance to maybe 400 because obviously that's one of the hardest events around? Yeah, I'd like to try it to be honest sometimes, so never know in a few years time I take up 400. Just, just talk us through your training from a, from a school's girl perspective when you're looking at training, how many times a week do you train and what do you do? Um, training like a total of five times a week after school, this is about three, four track sessions as well as weight sessions in the gym, so it's busy especially with school as well. So it could be quite difficult when you're trying to fit your studies in from everyone else, Tr trying to give our viewers a perspective on, on how you look at, at doing things. Oh, it's just a big commitment. So time keeping is the main thing. If you're organised with your time, it's fine.